grace from your hand fall on us. Dear Jesus, we are so, so very thankful and blessed to be here today to bring the two of us together in marriage, to begin a journey that really started before we were even born. Today, June 27th, 2015, I, Christopher Michael Casian, stand before our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and our dear family and friends that are here today to declare these eternal vows to you, Jesse Laura Leininger. Well, how did our journey start? Our plan was designed well before we were born. It began with the God of love shaping our hearts to be here today ready and worn. I was late for church on a February Sunday. <laughs> Your friends were asking you to go. Christopher Michael Casion, this is the day that the Lord has made, so let us rejoice and be glad because today, as we stand before God, our families and our friends, I choose you for life. God's goodness and faithfulness is undeniable and you are my living proof that he hears our prayers. On February 19th, 2012, <laughs> the Lord moved in our lives and divinely placed us in each other's path. I knew from the moment I met you that you were different. I could see a light in you that was so bright and a passion for the Lord that inspired me. On that February day, a very special friendship between us had begun. I don't believe that uh, people come together out of coincidence. Chris and Jesse were brought together. I remember when Chris told me that it was at a church parking lot where they first saw each other. My dearest Christopher, as I sit here writing to you, I hear the raindrops on the window. I don't look at the rain as a bad thing but as something good and pure. This is the happiest day of my life. I have waited so long for this day, and honey, it was well worth the wait. You are the greatest gift God has given me, and I am so proud to get to call you my husband in just a couple of hours. We are getting married. There will be no more empty beds, empty houses, long drives home waiting for the next time we see each other. Today, we become one forever and who knows where the road will take us next. For me, it doesn't matter, because I know it will always be with you. I remember a day in early 2012 when I got a call from Jesse about a guy, the guy. She randomly met him while attending a church neither had ever been to. They had literally Googled a church to go to and ran into each other trying to find the entrance. They became great friends, and three years later, realized they were each other's better half. Looks like it wants to. After getting to know Chris myself, I couldn't agree more. I look at my best friend today and I see a sparkle of just pure love and joy. It's by far the happiest I've ever seen her. Best man oh, in the past. Right. If you knew, well you do, how long he has waited for you, I mean, the patience that both of you have had. I can't imagine the reward that has come today.
Husbands, love your wives just as Christ also loved the church and gave himself up for her so that he might sanctify her, having cleansed her by the washing of water with the word, that he might present to himself the church in all her glory, having no spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that she would be holy and blameless. I will be faithful to you alone, pursuing you all the days of my life. Together, God will build us a loving home. And you will always be my wife. I will work hard as we build our life together, striving to put your needs above my own and striving to listen more than I speak. <laughs> I will lean on Christ to mold me into the supportive and patient wife you deserve. Your needs will always be on my mind, even if that means watching the Steelers. Your team, I will tune into the Eagles another place, another time. <laughs> If they could just win the big one, that is my dream. Should we be blessed to become parents, and I pray we have many, hmm. I will be a godly role model to our children, instilling important life values, teaching them well, and loving them with all my heart. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Casey on. Raising children with Jesse is something that I think we've both been looking forward to for a very long time. And a close second would be her cooking me dinner. <laughs> Having my best friend be near me every day. We've had a distance relationship and we've made that work, but it certainly will be nice seeing him every morning and every night. He's been a real blessing to me, not only as a as a disciple, but as a, uh, as a friend. Chris, you are one of the sweetest, most caring men I've ever met. You genuinely have a good heart, and I couldn't have picked a better, a more perfect man for my best friend. Jesse joined my family 12 years ago, and I'm happy to welcome you to it as well.